This is the resolution passed by city councilors Monday night by a vote of five to two. Let me read you a little bit of it. No city official shall question, arrest, detain, or take other law enforcement action against an individual based only upon the individual's perceived race, national origin, religion, or language, unless there's information that person is connected to criminal activity. Now, this is a policy which has already been in place at the police department and with past administrations here in the city, but now it's an official resolution. This is ceremonial but meaningful. Reverend Carolyn Paterno says the resolution helps ensure the civil rights and sense of safety for undocumented immigrants living in New London. We want to, as a city, show um, our support, knowing that uh, most are looking earnestly for a path to citizenship. Uh, I strongly believe that the uh, issues regarding uh, immigration are federal issues, and they have no business being discussed or acted on locally. City Councilor Martin Olson voted against the resolution, which is a scaled-back version of the ordinance the group had wanted when the process began in February of 2017. Reverend Paterno says it does not make New London a sanctuary city like New Haven and San Francisco. They have very, um, very stridently said that they will not cooperate with the federal government, basically. New London, this, this, this resolution does not go that far. Even though this grassroots group had originally wanted an ordinance, not a resolution, we're told that they have no plans right now to pursue any other action by the city council. In New London, Tina Detell, News 8.